Howdy guys, today we are checking out Seduction, which is a Debian-based system. It's in fact based on the Debian Unstable branch. Knowing Debian, of course, it's not really that unstable. Think of it more as a version of Debian with newer, rolling release package system. Alrighty, it's Seduction with an I, by the way. I love some good wordplay, but this distro was surprisingly more than just a cutesy name. There was actually a lot to like about. And let's get the installer going so we can get into it. Definitely want non-free packages. This, by the way, is the LXUT version of the distro. There's also a KDE and XFCE versions available. With Debian, I tend to have it running on some older hardware, and LXQT is as lightweight as you can get and still be easy to use. Oh boy, I love this sort of stuff. Bring on the nostalgia. Looks like these are how their older desktops looked. I only wish they'd made the image a bit bigger, maybe twice the size. So yeah, a very capable and easy installer. And let's come back once that's all complete. Really smart boot up screen. Wow, great work. I don't think I've ever seen one with options to change language or keyboard or time zones. And there's even a help. Alrighty, and here we are. Now, I have tweaked things a little, so it's not the out of the box experience as such, but it's still pretty close. LXQT comes with just the right amount of appearance tweaks. It is after all pretty lightweight, but still attractive. The default shine theme is also one of the best I've seen, so I'm sticking with that. And, of course, the LXQT file manager is one of the best things about it. Righto, on to the meat of it. The application Seduction comes with is what impressed me. I mean, come on, Vim? 10 out of 10 for me. Most other LXQT distros have needed a bit of work for me to be fully usable. Maybe some app here or a widget here. But Seduction is chock full of fun stuff. I mean, who doesn't love Inkscape? And the LibreOffice suite is a great addition as always. And this one is the best Audacious Media Player, or should I say, the open source Winamp clone. Another massive tick from me. This being a Debian disro, I guess we should. Also check out the Synaptek Package Manager. Oops, let's actually have a look at the repository settings as well. As you can see, it's using the unstable or SID branch of the packages. Debian has a running theme with Toy Story, by the way. You should Google that. Also, I should probably mention, if you wanna try Seduction, make sure you Google Seduction Linux at the end or you might mess up your search history. Anyway, this review has been a bit unexpected for me. I came for the pun in their name, but I've stayed for and been pretty impressed by the entire package. I'm gonna say if you wanna use LX, or if you want a Debian distro, that's not as ancient as the Debian stable branch generally is, then Seduction gets a big tick from me. Well, everyone, thanks for watching and please like and subscribe. Until next time.